When you swipe one of these, do you actually know what you're paying for? Yeah, we're talking about transaction fees that some stores charge when customers use a credit card. It's not always clear how much you're paying and what for. That is until a new law kicks in this weekend to make your receipt more transparent. Now this change uh, getting a lot of attention online. More than 15,000 people have read our story online, so we're diving deeper into the topic tonight. The new law here passed in December will now require businesses to disclose any surcharges for credit card users. Before that change takes effect Sunday, 7 News reporter Kristen Moran takes us through what you can expect to help you make ends meet. Cash or card? You may have noticed that it's sometimes cheaper to pay with cash to avoid a credit card surcharge. That's what Jennifer Matijakowski tells me she experienced recently. I went into a place and they actually told me they charge more for credit and they said if you can pay cash then we prefer it. So what did you end up doing? Well, I ended up paying cash. She tells me she's just learning about a new state law that goes into effect Sunday. It says businesses can pass along credit card fees to you as long as they clearly state you'll have to pay a little extra for using a card. I didn't know they were changing the law, though, that they had to tell you, so that's a great thing. So the governor laid out a few do's and don'ts for businesses to know once this law goes into effect. There's a couple of things that vendors can do here, like list the credit card price and put it right next to the cash price, or list the credit card price and let customers know that there is a cash discount, or just put everything down as the credit card price. The surcharge is not supposed to be a profit center. It's really just supposed to offset the cost of doing business or processing credit card transactions. Um, that average is about 2.2%. Ted Rossman is a senior industry analyst at Bankrate. He says the larger part of the surcharge war is between merchants and card companies. So he says you have two options when faced with a fee. The main options you have are to either vote with your feet and take your business elsewhere or pay with the optimal payment method. Like in my example, I like this pizza place. I just pay with cash now to save the processing fee. So bottom line here, if you are going to be checking out at a restaurant or at a store, you should know if there's going to be a fee when using your credit card and businesses should be laying that out to you. But no, this law does not apply to debit cards. Krista Moran, 7 News.